she goes to the bathroom and I figure out from there instead. But then she realizes the boss is in the stall next to her. So Mandy throws a cigarette into the toilet and the whole thing catches on fire. No fucking way. <laughs> what are you doing in here? Hey, that's my fucking coffee. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax, you guys. First of all, this is anything but coffee. And secondly, I'm here because head office hired me to run a pen test on your system. And good job, guys. You passed. Yeah. Hey, Ray. Hey, it's Tobias. Uh, yeah. Everything's solid here. Okay, yeah, I'll tell him. She wants me to check your routers, too. Yeah. Yeah, okay, will do. Thanks. Bye now. Pencil pushers. What can you do, huh? Hey. Hey! Bloom will know I'm here. I gotta move. I had high hopes for Bloom when I applied. I fell for the whole damn sales pitch. I knew we'd do something groundbreaking, but this thing was broken from the get-go. Now I'm too late, and the CTOS is too big. If I play it smart, I can trap some of these mouth breathers in their offices. Hey! Keep an eye in the hallway. I'll check the office. Oh. All right. Okay, that's weird. Man, does nothing ever work around here? Security convention in town? I never saw security guards. Who's there? What's going on? Hey, I... Raymond Kenny. No fucking way. Here? Hey, that's one of ours. Search over there. There's nothing here. Moving on. Don't see Jack. Gonna check somewhere else. I got nothing. Whoa!
Doesn't look right. Poor son of a bitch. <gasps> Go get him. No way he's gone. Start looking. here for now, but I'm gonna have to find a vulnerability pronto.
she wrote. Time to bail. Well, shit. All that just for little old me. dumped a false trail into Bloom's system. Over the next two weeks, they're gonna see me pop up in Wichita, Amarillo, Tucson. I'll drop off their map somewhere in Mexico. Are you heading the other direction? Hey, I've got a one-way cruise out of Miami. If things ever calm down, I'll find a way to contact you. But... You take care of yourself, T-Bone. Stay out of trouble this time. Oh, I intend to. Adios, amigo. Adios. I'm home.
First rule of survival, always use the back door. Or is it, never make a copy of the key. You ain't pretty, you ain't cozy, and you're sure as shit ain't home. But you were there for me when I needed you, baby. Need to wake up my guard dogs. I gotta burn these hard drives in the morning. Oh, I never got to use these. I guess it's better to be an unfulfilled paranoid than a dead one. Last night in the rabbit hole. Oh, I should get some shut eye. It's been ten years, Frewer. Ray? This had better be good. Ray, send the police. No, wait. Don't send the police. They may be in on it. Can you find me? Calm down. This is another one of your episodes. My episodes? Ray, they're gonna kill me. Do you understand? They who? I don't know. They, they hit me with something. I, I must have blacked out. I, I, th I think maybe I'm in a trunk. I'm definitely in a trunk, right? Can you track me? <sighs> Not very well. Your GPS signal's cutting in and out. Oh, of course. Oh, they're jamming it. Oh, this is bad. Like, fixer bad. Fuck. All right, I'm on my way. Sounds like Brewer's in real danger here. But if I'm gonna get out of Chicago, it needs to be now. Fuck. I can't just leave him. Fuck down. Now, feel around the latch for a trunk release. If it's a newer car, it'll have one. Uh, nope, nothing. All right, so we know we're in an old car. It's a start. Old car? No, that is not a start. Maybe they removed the trunk latch. You got any tools back there with you? Check for a compartment. There might be a jack in it. Yeah. Yeah, there's a jack. I think I can pop the lid with one of these. That's the idea, but we don't want them to hear it pop. So I want you to bang around a lot when you do it. And shout, too. Hmm? Okay, here it goes. Hey! Hey, let me out of here! Help! Help! It's open. It worked. Just crack the lid. Tell me what you see. I see construction workers on the road. This is Chicago. That could be anywhere. Oh! Road cones! I see a lot of road cones. Road cone? Road cone? Road cones, buildings for businesses. What do you see? Oh, that's no, no, I don't know what that is. Come on, man. There's a half demolished apartment building. Looks like housing projects. Sounds like you're in the wards. Good, Frewer. Anything else? Just a lot of buildings, right? Do they say anything? Well, I can't see. 
said he was homeless, doped up on something barely coherent. <laughs> Hell, Frewer probably still blames me for all his problems. Get me out! Get me out! at me, says the lunatic with the tire iron. I'm not a lunatic. So you gonna tell me what you did to piss off the fixers? Me? <laughs> this is on you. I'm still running from your mess. I have been ever since you and Rose decided to blow whistles at Bloom. I had a good life, Ray. You sure fooled me. We had to walk around on eggshells because you were such a head case. <laughs> well, Rose is dead now, and your little tantrum in 2003. How many people died? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm the head case. <laughs> you little shit. I'm sorry, I didn't. I, I... You know what? Thanks for the rescue. But I need to go. Eleven. Eleven people died. Lindsay Garcia. Jeremy Connors. You want more? Because I can list them all for you. If you run, Bloom will find you. I know, because I'm the one who wrote the goddamn code that'll help him to do it. Now, I can get you out. But I need to hit Bloom again. 
Find out what the hell they know. You can stay at my place. Just don't touch my stuff. Don't monkey with my system. And don't make any noise. Yeah. I'll try to control myself. And most importantly, do not touch any of my beer. I don't drink. Of course you don't. <clears throat> Shit. Wasn't planning on sticking around. I need to make a call. Detective Billing speaking. Sheila. Mystery man, is that you? I assumed you were dead. Did you miss me? Nope. I love the growing tower of crime reports on my desk. Please tell me that's why you called. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm running low on cash. And supplies. Well, there's plenty to do. Every gangbanger, goon, and gorilla's out there fighting for a piece of the cake now that Lucky Quinn and Iraq are dead. And I'm running out of people to trust within the department. Just pull me in the right direction and I'll do the dirty work. Or a fee. Taxpayer money, keeping the thugs off the streets. Ain't it beautiful when the system works, sweetheart? <laughs> you are bad. Hold on, I'll send you what I've got. Let me check my map. I've marked one of the groups for you. The Chicago South Club. Now spearheaded by Quinn's baby boy. All right. Some of these will be one-time targets of opportunity, and some of them will be done to send a message. Hit those once a day, so they know we're watching. Just remember, if you get caught... Never heard of you. Good. Give me a call before you go in.